so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great and today's video i'm going to talk about the blender 4.2 new update regarding the ev bloom basically so what happened exactly in the previous version you can easily see the bloom into the render property section but right now on the 4.2 version you won't be able to see any bloom option here so now the question is that how we can get the bloom so for that what you have to do basically you have to create your scene and add the light according to your desire and after that you have to just go to the compositing section and here you have to just click the use node and after that you have to just add one viewer node something like that and you have to just plug this view or something like that okay and before like adding the uh, viewer node make sure you just hit a render something like that what i'm gonna do i will just add one camera frame here and i will just hit the f12 so here you can see this is our render is happening and right now on my screen you can see we don't have any bloom effect into our pumpkin so what i will do basically i will again go to my compositing and here i will get my renders all right so make sure you just hit the render before using the compositor and then you have to just add the uh, one more node it's called basically clear node and you have to just plug it here and here we go guys here you will be able to see the bloom option here you can see and from here you can just maintain the what we can say threshold of the bloom here you can see higher number will the decrease the bloom and lower number will the increase the bloom here you can see so in ev now you will able to see the bloom into the compositing section and also if you want to see your, your camera view so you have to just switch the compositor as a camera you will also able to see into your viewport but if you just exit from the camera mode still you're not able to see so what do you have to do again you have to just go to the like what we can say viewport shading option and you have to just click the always now you will able to see live into the viewport as well so that's how you can use the bloom option a bloom effect into the blender 4.2 which is latest release by the blender foundation so thanks for watching the video guys and this is very short and very uh, informative video so i hope you enjoyed this video and will learn something new from the video so make sure you hit the like button and the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries or conversation please let me know in the comment box i'll definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys i love you all